It's not just people who travel to the Sun Coast for the beaches. Endangered sea turtles make their trip every year. Nesting season officially kicks off today. SNN's Samantha Sonner has more. Sea turtle nesting season is off to a good start on the Sun Coast. The turtles are here. They've uh, just started nesting. They actually read the calendar really well this year. Um, we got our first nest on um, Sunday, yesterday, the 30th. And, but now that it's the first, we're officially in season. The first three nests were found in Venice, but moat staff biologist Melissa Bernhard says they expect many more after last year's record breaking 4,588. We're just seeing numbers going up and up and up, and so this year we don't know what's going to happen. They could double again, um, or it could be about the same, but we, we know there are going to be lots of turtles here this year. There are a few things to be aware of during nesting season. Now that it's after May 1st, all lights uh, are supposed to be turned off or turtle friendly. Uh, the lighting can distract the turtles from the ocean and actually prevent them from getting back. There are a few simple things everyone leaving the beach can do to make a sea turtle's journey easier. Pulling your beach furniture off the beach, getting that out of their way so they don't get stuck by it. If you do go to the beach just for fun and you build a big sandcastle, the best thing there is to knock it down when you're done. Keep the beach as natural as possible. And of course, don't disturb the marked off nests. As long as you are respectful of, you know, the crawls that you see and if you see any turtles, uh, give them their space, then should be a good season. Nesting season lasts through October 31st. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Sun Coast News Network. And you can visit SNNTV.com for information on how you can keep up with weekly sea turtle counts here locally.